Well, Palm Sunday, oh boy, a special day. You see the banners in the back, right behind me, way back there, making it a special day with Jesus riding into Jerusalem on a donkey, a special day. And Easter is the next week, and in between Palm Sunday and Easter, so many important things happen in Jesus' life and all of them together show us how much God loves us and we see who God is. But I know your story in your children's Bible is not about Palm Sunday. It's one of the great stories of the Bible. So many people know it. It's the parable, the story that Jesus tells of the father's love for a son who is not a very good son for some of the time. I'm sure you've read the story. Maybe you've heard it. Sometimes you call it the story of the son who gets lost. Sometimes you tell the story of the father who loves his son no matter what. Here's how I like to tell the story. A little bit different from Jesus, which is a little different also from your children's Bible. Just think of somebody in college here at UT Martin who goes to his daddy and says, I want all of the money that I'm going to get when you die, which is kind of like saying, I don't care if you live or not. And the daddy gives him a bunch of money, and he goes out and buys a big fancy truck, and he goes down to Memphis and gets a big hotel room, and he has big parties, and before long he's out of money, and rather than living in a nice big hotel room, he's out on the street and he's having to eat food out of the garbage can. And he says, you know, my daddy back in Martin has a good business and he's doing things. I'll go see if I can just work for him. And he goes back and as he's coming back to Martin, his daddy sees him coming in the truck and his daddy runs down the driveway and says, come on out, let's have a party. You're back home. I've loved you and I've loved you and I've never stopped loving you. That's kind of the way I like to tell the story. A little bit different. Jesus didn't know about trucks, you know, no, no, or didn't tell about them, no. But it's a story about a son who doesn't love his father as he should. A son who doesn't think about losing all that money. Do you, do you think that we sometimes don't love our Father in heaven the way we should? Do you think that we sometimes, especially through the whole of our lives, that we might sometimes forget about God? I think it's possible. And yet to remember that God doesn't forget about us. Why don't you talk to your mother and daddy, to your parents, your grandparents today, uh, over Sunday dinner, and ask them if they know of anybody who ever just strayed away from their family and who came back. If they know of anybody where there was problem in the family but things got fixed and the family was happy about that. Or maybe ask your parents if there's sometimes they forget God, even if it's for just a day or two. And ask yourself, do I forget God sometimes for a day or two and not remember how much he loves me? Again, I'll say it one more time. If you and I forget God and stray away, run away, the wonderful thing is God does not forget us and God continues to wait for us to come back. That's a wonderful story. I told it about a truck and a college person. You have a children's Bible that tells it a little bit different. Something you could do, go to the 15th chapter of Luke, Luke chapter 15, and read the story. That would be a great thing. Read it as Jesus tells it. Love you. Let's pray together. Dear God, we thank you for your love. And we thank you that you never forget us. 
We thank you that you're patient with us. And you are always waiting for us. Ready to pick us up in your arms. And hold us. We pray this in Jesus who teaches us to pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. Amen. I'll see you soon.